The next thing to do was really to get this house safe for Mia. So I took the family shopping to get some baby proof items. However, little Max wasn't in the mood to go shopping. Max, you hold on to the cart. He's not holding on to the cart. Max, you need to come and hold on to the cart. Thank you. Max started in with his usual behavior. Max, where are you going? Really? I'm going to hand that over to you, Mum. I'm going to give you a warning. Do not take your hand off the cart. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Do you understand? He wasn't listening, wasn't following directions. Uh, he's he's gone again. Do I tell him he's going to have a time out? Like, I just warned him. Mom, put your phone oh, Max, I need to talk to you. Because you let go of the cart after I told you not to, when we get home, you're going to have a time out. Max, stop right now. You're not going to get a gumball today because you didn't listen to me. Okay. Max kicked off. He was screaming at the top of his lungs. I want to get a gumball! And Mum and Dad were beside themselves with embarrassment of how to deal with this situation. I want a gumball! If we would have given him the gumball, then that would let him know it's okay that he, he can let go of the cart and not follow directions. Come back to the cart. I want a Stop, 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 stop for a minute. Right now, I want you to hold on to that cart and stop messing around. Right now. That's enough. Jen and Tony found what they were looking for, but they still need to follow through with discipline when they got home. When we all arrived back at the house, it was time to put Max straight on timeout. I am putting you on a timeout because you kept letting go of the basket and you did not listen to me. And I need you to stay here for four minutes. No! Get a timer? Just have the timer. We saw Jen implement a timeout with Max. And he tested her on that as well. It got really ugly for a while, but having Joe there allowed me to carry through and not give in. But eventually, through Jen's perseverance, he did stay in the timeout, and we did get the first discipline ever executed. Max, mommy put you on a timeout because you did not hold on to the cart like I asked you to. When Jenny was doing the timeout with Max, I thought she did a great job. Um, she really stuck to her guns. Sorry. Okay. Have a hug. I felt really good at the end of the timeout because that's probably one of the first times Tony or myself have really stuck with the punishment. I love you. 